Hi everyone, welcome back to JPWHU TV. My name is John, your host as always, and I hope you're doing well as I always do. This is a quick reaction video to the news that The Athletic put up earlier, which confirmed that Vladimir Soufal has signed a three-year contract extension with an option for a further year. This is unbelievably good news, really, really good news. Now, as we know, when he, when he signed with, for us, he was signed until 2023. He's now obviously committed to the club for, for a further three years on top of that by the looks of things. And so therefore, that he's going to be with us for the next five years minimum. Fantastic news. Great move by the club. Um, we know there was a lot of talk over the last few months about his contract negotiations and the agent wasn't happy and he wasn't happy, blah, 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 blah. Even though that may be true or not is irrelevant because at the end of the day, he's now signed the contract. And this is what I said in the tweet. If you're not following the channel on Twitter, to go follow us at JPWHUTV. I said there's only two people you really need to listen to. Don't don't listen to Sky Sports, Talk Sport, whatever. There's only two people you should really be listening to, and I've maintained it for the last few years now, ex-West Ham employee, of course, and also The Athletic. They are the two most reliable sources on social media. Don't listen to anyone else. Having said that, <laughs> there is. I'm doing a video next week uh, because obviously this coming week is the international break. We will be doing the England watch-alongs as usual, so come and join us for that. Um, but I will be doing a video next week in relation to some bullshit that David Sullivan has leaked to Jim White about the outstanding debt of the club. So keep an eye out for that. I've been thinking about it for a good few weeks. The international break is the perfect time to do it and will reinforce why I'm still GSB out. So, but in the meantime, guys, as I say, in terms of Vladimir Soufal, this is an unbelievably good move by the club. I'm glad everybody got, got things sorted. We can rest easy now in the same way that we can rest easy in relation to what Declan Rice said earlier in the week about how committed he is to the club, how much he loves the club, putting, brushing aside all those stupid rumours about him being tracked by Man United, Chelsea, whoever. You know, he, he, he may be. He still may be. But, guys, just, I've always said it, don't... Don't listen to anybody until it comes out of the horse's mouth. That's it. As simple as that. And obviously there, there will be some, I'm guessing there's going to be some confirmation probably tomorrow from the club to confirm that Sue Fowler signed his contract as well. But guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below as always. I'm very, very happy with this. Really happy. Um, it's, like I say, it's a great move by the club. And let me know your thoughts. And if I don't see you on the GSB out um, move, the peaceful protest tomorrow i will see you later on in the afternoon or the evening i should say when we do the final thoughts for the brentford game guys also for that matter watch these videos <laughs> one minute 27 seconds was the average view time of my last few videos come on guys you, you, you i know you want more than content and that don't just click on the video and put your comments in the section listen to what i have to say before we talk about it it's as simple as that but guys we are so so close to 2000 subscribers now we've got we've still got 714 returning subscribers so come on hit that hit that the um hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell let's get us to 2000 we are so close to it it's 56 at the time of this recording and I, but anyway guys enjoy the rest of your weekend i hope to see you friday sorry sunday evening in, in the comment section for when we talk about the brentford game all the best now take care